Hello everyone and good evening to you guys. I do not own the rights to this music Facebook. Just thought I'd put that out there. But I just wanted to take a minute with you guys. Um, I had some uh, food for thought for all of you and I guess just a word on my heart to share with you all. So there are many times in our day-to-day -day moments that we become anxious, we become frustrated, and even frazzled um, at the wonders of how our day goes and what is to come next. And I had this, I guess, calling on my heart to just bring joy and peace into every circumstance and bring it to the Lord and know that this is a blessing. This is a moment in time and I truly believe that in this these days Jesus is calling us to be awake to him. So there's a lot of things that are being revealed in our lives. There's um you know I feel like there's a lot that's being addressed in our 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 uh, personal lives as well as spiritual and public lives with others and just relationships um, because the Holy Spirit is working you guys he's wanting to convince us and let us know that there is sin out there and without being able to see that there is sin, then we don't see the solution as Jesus. We don't see, um, like, if you really think about it, you guys, if we get everything, one second, if we get everything we ever asked for, would we take the time to truly pray and sit with the Lord? Would we, like, seek to find Him and understand who He is and what He has for us and what our true identity is? And would we count our blessings? Would we count those small victories and those those little things that we, we tend to surpass as it is? Um, you know, I've found that God is really pointing out a lot to me, and I'm working on a lot for myself and my family. And I just want to say, like, Jesus is amazing. He is truly working through all of this. And he's asking us to just step away from the worldly ways and just step into this journey with him and know and trust that he is there and he is working things all out for good. Um, and I have this verse that's really on my heart to share with you guys. In James 1, 2 through 6, um, God calls us, which I'll put the verse above, but God calls us to have joy in trials. And joy in these times of trouble, um, confusing, and uh, we have to remember, now there's two different things. There is temptations and there is testing. God tests you. He tests your faith. He tests who you are as your capabilities because he knows that he has made you something for so much bigger than what we do on our day-to-day -day lives. Um, and then we have the temptations, and that comes from the enemy. That comes to tear us down. That comes with um, this spiritual battle that uh, these spirits that we aren't even aware of really take over and can hop from one person to the next. But I want to just take a step back and like let's look at everything that God may be trying to address with us. Let's say... It could be our eating habits. It can be our um, our phone habits, being on our phones. It can be us as parents. There may be some um, trials in that, trials in relationships, trials in growth, trials in success. And as us as um, we wanting what we want and what we think is best for our lives, we find ourselves getting frustrated when we slip and these things don't fall the way that we'd like it to. But can't we see that if we just hold on to God and we continue to walk this journey and trust in Him, that there is this overall abundance that comes into our lives that we would never have and we would never um, seek to find if we were just doing it on our own. So I feel like I just needed to share this with you that maybe tonight you can have a moment of reflecting and just 
bringing God in the mix of it all and truly um, embracing his presence in your life and counting your blessings this month. Um, I will put that verse above if you want to meditate on that tonight and just find joy and peace and bring God into your trials. You know, really talk about those things with him and find that it is a blessing if things don't fall out right. There is a something better coming your way. There is something so much more that you can't see beyond the horizon. And God is going to put that in your life. And you have to trust and believe in that and, uh, and you know, be in his presence. So take joy tonight. Take peace tonight with all the chaos in the world and you know really embrace the trials and just know that you can conquer anything especially especially when you have God there um, to build you up and walk with you through those trials so my friends I just wanted to pop in tonight give you some food for thought hopefully this brightened your mind and your heart and your spirit and I hope you have a beautiful evening and I will see you guys again soon thank you God bless